Motor Week is made possible by Lucas Oil and TireRack.com. While the past few years haven't been particularly kind to General Motors, one bright spot has been at Pontiac, a division that's experienced sales far above average and produced Motor Week's Driver's Choice winner for Best Domestic Sedan in 1990, 91, and 92. Fortunately, Pontiac isn't content with past successes. It keeps varying its product mix. Here's a good example, the Bonneville SLE sedan. Let's see if it has what it takes to be another Pontiac winner. Judged on styling alone, the Pontiac Bonneville SLE certainly looks like a winner. Our car's uniformly excellent dark green metallic paint enhanced the Bonnie stylish Euro sedan lines. The SLE is the sport luxury edition of the SE sedan, which accounted for a whopping 82% of Bonneville sales last year. Unlike the bolder Bonneville SSE and SSEI, styling touches for the latest model are more subtle. This emblem is one way to recognize the SLE. The unique smallish oval grille is another. And then there is the body colored cladding, which fits better than that on our 92 SSEI long-term car. Helping brighten the mostly monotone SLE is a narrow chrome strip that encircles the entire car, as on a Mercedes and the C-pillar reminds us of larger BMWs. Massive wraparound taillights and a large protruding rear bumper highlight the rear, along with this deck lip mounted spoiler. SLE buyers can specify gold or silver toned 16 inch aluminum wheels on which are mounted 60 series Goodyear Eagle GA tires. Standard on most Bonnevilles is GM's normally aspirated 3800 V6 engine. With tuned port fuel injection, the 3.8 liter unit delivers 170 horsepower and 225 pound-feet of torque to the front wheels. We found it well suited to everyday driving. And at the track, where it took our SLE from 0 to 60 in only 8.8 .8 seconds, a strong showing for a large family sedan. It finished the quarter mile in 16.5 seconds, ending at 84 miles per hour. Power was steady throughout the rev band but we'd welcome a bit more mid-range for passing. Transferring the SLE's punch to the pavement is an electronically controlled four-speed automatic transmission. Our test car also featured a low-speed traction control system, part of an optional performance and handling package. that also includes sport suspension and sometimes heavy variable effort power steering. Our test drivers raved about the SLE's handling. They were impressed that this large front-wheel drive car exhibited such mild understeer, not to mention a rear end that never tried to break loose, and a confidence-inspiring high-speed lane change. The SLE package greatly improves the Bonneville's already competent handling. The Tevis anti-lock braking system is now standard on all Bonnevilles, with disc in the front and drums in the rear. They stopped the 3,362-pound SLE from 60 in a decent average distance of 124 feet. Although that's the best average we've achieved on any ABS-equipped Bonneville we've tested, we still think it should be a bit shorter. One thing that Pontiac has improved this year is the Bonneville's fuel economy. The EPA city estimate is now 19, while highway mileage remains at 28. Excellent figures for such a large car. Expect 24 in normal driving conditions. The SLE lives up to its middle name, Luxury, with soft leather and thick carpeting dominating the interior. The front bucket seats are among the best we've experienced in a volume sedan, providing fine support and comfort. Besides a driver's airbag, the cockpit features convenient ergonomics and no plastic wood. There is an arching dash that extends out from and over the instrument pod. Gauges are large, attractive analog units that offer the full instrumentation we expect but often don't find in sports sedans. One-seated SLE drivers can utilize a great variety of power and manual adjustments along with a tilt wheel to find that optimal driving position. Height adjustable seat belts certainly help. Rear seat passengers will also travel in comfort. Room is generous even for three. And the armrest hides a convenient pass-through to the trunk which provides a spacious 18 cubic feet of flat cargo space and a very low liftover. Price-wise, the SLE compares well with other family-oriented sports sedans, large or small. The SLE package adds $3,489 to the Bonneville SE's $19,444.
our test car's performance and handling package, plus remote keyless entry brought its total to $23,333. That price includes an impressive list of safety features, a driver's side airbag, anti-lock brakes, traction control, and five mile per hour front bumpers. A passenger airbag is expected this fall. Our list of hits begins with styling. We already like the Bonneville's aggressive but sophisticated look, and the SLE package makes a good thing better. Handling is a close second. It's superb for such a big car, as is the SLE's luxurious leather interior. And we applaud Pontiac for giving the SLE full instrumentation and designing such a driver-friendly dash. Misses are few besides the brakes, which while competent, could be better, and we'd like more mid-range torque for passing. We're not surprised that Bonneville sales have remained strong. We have long considered the Pontiac Bonneville to be one of the best sedans on the market. And this SLE package is pure enhancement.